Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to talk about botulinum toxin and its use in ENT. What is botulinum toxin? Botulinum toxin was first identified as a poison in the 19th century. The toxin, which is a protein, is produced by a gram-positive anaerobic bacterium called Clostridium botulinum. The name botulus means sausage. It is found in variety of foods but is most common in meat products. There are various types of botulinum toxin. It is broken down into seven neurotoxins type A, B, C1, C2, D, E, F and G. In medical practice type A and B are most commonly used. Now what is the mechanism of action of botulinum toxin? At neuromuscular junction, it prevents the release of neurotransmitter acetylcholine. Therefore, it results in flaccid paralysis of the skeletal muscle, smooth muscle and reduced secretion from some glands. This chemical denervation of the muscle fiber is reversible. Now, what are the uses of botulinum toxin in ENT? From the mechanism of action, we have understood that it is used clinically to either paralyze muscle that is overactive or to reduce secretions from gland. Through this anticholinergic effect, botulinum toxin is a suitable therapeutic option for dysfunctions of muscular and the autonomic nervous system. The conditions are spasmodic dysphonia jore bolen bari kothay ki koren apni oboshor ache age ki korten shikkhokota shikkhokota dysphagia facial hyperkinesia that is blepharospasm hemifacial spasm Phrase syndrome, siloria, postparodidectomy fistula, migraine and tension type of headache, complex dystonias like oromandibular dystonia, laryngeal dystonia, cervical dystonia. Oculo pharyngeal myoclonus, stuttering, essential vocal tremor, achalasia cardia. A new indication of botulinum toxin application may involve the treatment of nasal hypersecretion through the effect on nasal glands. So what are the results after botulinum toxin injection? The positive therapeutic effect starts a few days after treatment and lasts longer in disorders of the autonomic nervous system. As the effect is temporary, the patient needs for the treatment and it can be repeated every three to four months. Side effects from botulinum toxin injection are rare. There may be mild pain, edema, local erythema at the injection site, transient numbness, headache, mild nausea and influenza-like illness may be seen. Temporary weakness, neck weakness, paralysis of the nearby musculature, fatigue, dysphagia, brachial plexopathy, dry mouth, and sometimes hypersensitivity may be seen. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.